First of all, I think we should all be very proud to be here. It's the spirit of Swaha that brings us together. It's the spirit of being proud Hindu that brings us together. And I really appreciate giving one of my most favorite topic. My topic is importance and means of instilling Vedic values in childhood. So I have three daughters at home. I've been very busy with practice, with residencies, with fellowships, nine years after medical school. But then you realize that is that really success? How do we measure success? When you talk about a definition of success in Vedic values, is it by being a high up in your profession? Does it come with your monetary value? Does it come how expensive of a car you drive? I think when you want to answer what is the value, what is the real Vedic success, it is in the principles of Arya Samaj. It is in the principles of Arya Samaj. You have to rise, but you have to bring every, the whole society you have to rise, you have to bring with you. Otherwise, it's not a true success. Because you come to a point and then you'll say, is, it, is this it? Is this what I have attained? There's a lot more to be attained. So now let me talk about my, I only have 10 minutes. I've already used a couple minutes here, so I gotta speed up. Importance and means of instilling Vedic value in childhood. So that topic itself is childhood. And I'm gonna add another letter to it. Childhood in United States. Because that is my problem. That is, I'm the guy Dr. Balveer Singh was talking about. His son is going to a different, he is curious. He is one of the most intelligent, learned guy who's out here. But his kid, his own son, I'm the guy who stand outside on the door. Can I come in or I can leave? If you do not have what I need, I'm not gonna come in. If you do not have what my child needs, doesn't matter what background I come from, doesn't matter how Arya Samaji my parents were, doesn't matter how many people stand up here and talk about Ved, Upanishad, and anything else, doesn't matter how many PowerPoints you can put up there. If you do not have what I need in my daily life, I'm not gonna come in. I'm gonna walk away why is our number so short? Because it is a Rolls Royce. It is not a Ford. Rolls Royce is expensive. You have to work hard for it. You sell eight or nine in a year, you're happy. That dealership is one of the top in the country. Focus comes by a dozen. You have to work hard to become an Ari Samaji. Let go of Arya Samaj, let go of, don't even talk about Maharshi Dayanand. Go beyond that. Talk about the Vedic philosophy. The second word in my title is Vedic. Why should I be Vedic? You heard a lot about Ved, you heard a lot about other things, so I'm not gonna touch on that. But only thing I wanna pass along is Vedic, the difference between a temple and Arya Samaj is we push for a way of life. We do not, our teaching starts outside of the doors. Their teaching is inside the door. Come in, do your puja, walk away, stand outside, do your namaste, walk away. But ours start outside the door. We say, take it home. You have to take Aris Samaj to home. That's why we fail to make more Arya Samajis. Now, what is the importance of all this? Join me in saying that every success, we talked about what is success, every goal in life starts with a thought. What is a thought? Thought is a mantra. If that doesn't get translated into feelings, that's where thought is gonna end. So here's the sequence, and Dr. Balveer, he talked about it's in Satyarth Prakash. 
So everything begins with, you can speak with me, thought, feeling, attitude, action, habit, personality, and then it ends with destiny. If you want to be successful, you have to hit every single mark. And if you want your kid to be successful, you can decide which mark you want to address. The most easiest mark for you to address is to affect their thought. And when would you affect their thought? Marjit Dhanan said there are 16 sanskars. How many sanskars are in adulthood? How many sanskars are in their childhood? Why? If you want to catch them, catch them young. Then you will blame. We have taught you to teach you. We have tried to take R.S. Samaj. We have taught R.S. Samaj. We have taught R.S. Samaj. We have taught R.S. Samaj. But R.S. Samaj आर्य समाज क्यों नहीं आया? Why did the आर्य समाज, why did the वैदिक वैल्यू did not transfer inside? Because they never understood a word they said. They never understand how many people have stopped. It's beautiful to do the whole हवन. It's gorgeous. It's it's I I I'm the first step on anything is learning. First step on anything is being able to recite. But the next step is trying to understand what you said. He said, Nara, Jo bole so abhe. How many of you stopped and thought about what you just said? You said, Jo bole so abhe. So you guys are not really fearless. If you would have fearless, you would have said it. Why should I be fearless? How many of you have passed on to your sons and daughters and talked about fear? You're okay to talk about smoking. You want to talk about sex. You want to talk about how the puberty. Why should I be dead? Are you afraid? I am. But why should I be fearless? Because apastrana masi, apidhana masi. God is all around me. I do not need a messenger. I do not need an in-between guy for me to recommend. I'm fearless because I feel the presence of God. How many of you have explained why is Havan Kund the way it is? Max Muller, somebody talked about Max Muller this morning. Maharishi Dayanand, he translated Agni into Ag. That's where his definition ended. Maharishi Dayanand sent him hundred things, hundred meanings of Ag, hundred meanings of Agni. Agre Agre Se Naiti Sa Agni. Why do we use fire? Agni Pide Murohitam. Purohitam, that's the mantra that's written. How many of you walked in and looked up and said what, what mantra is written there? And why is it written there? There are thousands of mantra, but that was the one chosen. So the meaning of all this is, yes, I love listening to all this. I love listening to Upanishad. I love somebody's telling me that this is yoga and this and that. But when the rubber meets the road, so we have been successful in adding 12 new families who have no Arya Samaji relationships because of our approach. So I'm not preaching. I'm saying try, use this approach. And the approach is do a Dainik Yaj. Stop in the middle. Explain everything. Explain everything to death over and over. Why I have you not? Why your, your son and daughters are doing Achman and have they no sense? Why are we using two middle fingers? Why are we using two middle fingers? Because there's a message in it. It is moderation. Then you ask, son, do you understand what moderation is? So I'll give you, I'm over time, and I, I think I'll cut into your snack time here. But, so let me, let me do an, so if I sit here, and I, I have a six esophagectomies to do next year, next week, 
Within next week and the week follow, I have six esophagectomies to do. That's the biggest operation I do. I can stand here and I start explaining you how to do an esophagectomy. Yes, I'm going to, you know, it's a distal esophageal adenocarcinoma. I'm going to mobilize the stomach. I'm going to make a conduit out of the stomach. I'm going to put it in the posterior mediastinum. I'm going to make an in incision in the left neck. I'll do my anastomosis in the left neck. How many people do understand English? All of you do. But how many can do that on Monday? Nobody. How many of you can regurgitate that to me? Nobody. And that's what this is going on. They don't, you don't even understand what an anastomosis means. You have no idea what a, what a, what a uh, conduit means. I was delighted to see the uh, patrika that was distributed. There is, on every page, there is a, the, the word from Samantwe and Asamantwe, the book written by Maharshi Dayanand. There is Prarthana, what is Upasana? Talk about, so let me tell you. So we pick a topic. So these are the 10 topics that you should, dis you should discuss. What is prayer? Why do I pray? And I'm talking about kids, I'm not talking about adults. And adults can also learn. What is prayer? What should be the components of prayer? What is God? What does Om mean? What does that three in the middle of Om mean? When you see it on the, on the, on the written on a sticker. What is success? We talked about that. What is fear? What is sharing? Talk about the, the, the atma and pran of yaj. I heard you guys did a, the yaj the, uh, last weekend. That was a havan. Yaj doesn't become yaj till you bring it inside. Every single aspect of it. Talk about sharing. Talk about being Hindu. Think about this question. How many of you can tell me why they are Hindu? Ask a Christian. What are your, there's a test at the end. There's a test before the conversion. Here, membership, check. Oh yeah, thank you very much. Did you talk about 10 principles of Arya Samaj? Let alone forget your mother, Swami Dayanan. Talk about principle of Arya Samaj. Have them meet with your whoever. See what's in the, in the in 10 principles of Arya Samaj. You cannot, we're not after Bhid. And we're not after Manoranjan. This is Atam Ranjan. This is not Manoranjan. There has to be an element of entertainment, otherwise you will not have anybody. There has to be Bhajan, there has to be Sangeet. There has to be entertainment, otherwise this will be Arya Samaj are stubborn. Arya Samaj are orthodox. We are not. We know how to stick to our principles because we believe in them. There is no compromise on the principles. You guys are talking about yoga, samadhi, this. I'm still stuck on yam and niyam. I, I'm stuck on, I'm on ahinsa. How many are non-vegetarians here? Of course. This is it, right? <laughs> but the idea is you have to take it home. It does not end in this door. Otherwise, you, it will be all random. If you do not know the, the rules of the game, the team you're playing for, and how to encourage your kid, and who's the coach, you are leaving your kids on random. This will, they will succeed because of poor Vijanam. But you have to know the rules. You have to know how to play the game. And guess what? We have it. We just need to package it better. Thank you.